Yellowstone Volcano. Imminent eruption will sound the alarm before a natural disaster, experts warn. Yellowstone Volcano would have provided ample warning to authorities to prepare widespread evacuations before an eruption occurred, a study of the supervolcano revealed. Yellowstone Volcano's last major eruption occurred about 640,000 years ago when it formed the volcanic caldera that millions of people visit today. Since then, the supervolcano has erupted about 80 times, spewing molten rock, volcanic ash and smoke. Experts at Yellowstone estimate that the supervolcano will erupt between 600,000 and 700,000 years. This has caused some people to worry that the Yellowstone system will experience another major volcanic explosion in the near future. Fortunately, scientists who study past supervolcanic eruptions around the world, believe that Yellowstone will roar long before it comes back to life. A study led by volcano researchers from the University of Illinois, UI, USA, found that supervolcanic eruptions were preceded by significant seismic activity over many years. Volcanoes like Yellowstone require warning signals tens or even hundreds of thousands of years before they erupt. Patricia Gregg, professor of geology at UI, explains, when new magma begins to rejuvenate a supervolcano system, we will see massive uplift, faulting, and earthquake activity. Much larger than the meter scale events we have seen recently. We are talking about lifting distances of tens to hundreds of meters. Even so, our model predicts that the system will expand for hundreds to thousands of years before we see a powerful eruption. Supervolcanoes like Yellowstone do not act and erupt in the same way as smaller volcanoes like Etna. Typically, volcanoes are thought to erupt when a buildup of pressure caused by swelling magma breaks through the volcano's rocky dome. But supervolcanoes tend to be active in areas experiencing significant tectonic stress. This is a part of the world where tectonic plates are constantly moving, rubbing against each other, and pulling against each other. Tectonic movements will impact how models predict supervolcano behavior. Fellow researcher and graduate student Haley Cabanis said, it doesn't matter whether it's extrinsional, compressional or shear stress. Any tectonic stress would help destabilize the rock and trigger an eruption, just on a slightly different time scale. The amazing thing we discovered is that the timing seems to depend not only on tectonic stress, but also on whether magma is actively being supplied to the volcano. Supervolcanoes can be dormant for very long periods of time, much longer than the lifetime of humanity. According to Professor Gregg, this could last for millions of years. Volcano experts say, 